Right, thought I'd do a bit of a video um, talking about this upcoming screening, this live stream, because some people are getting a bit confused about that. So I thought I'd um, just do a bit of a video to clear things up. <clears throat> so the live screening at Temple News and will be happening next Friday. So it's Friday the 2nd at 8 p.m. Now, the link for the, for the link for the screening is going to be sent out via Townsend. So I think sometime next week, probably I think Wednesday. Um, so the link will be sent out by Townsend to everyone who's bought a physical edition of the album. As I say, it's like a like a free gift, really. Then like a you know another way of celebrating that night, which was amazing, and um, I'm really looking forward to doing the live stream. And the footage is amazing. Trust me, the footage like. I'll talk about that a bit more in a second, but yeah. So there's been a couple of people saying, "Can we just buy? Um, can we just buy a ticket to the live stream? Just buy the album? Do you know what I mean? Just either buy the vinyl or the CD, the physical. That's how you get. That's how you get into the stream. So there's, there's kind of no point trying to find another way of. Oh well, can I sort of buy a ticket to the stream? Your ticket to the stream is the physical edition that you buy through towns, and um, and that might annoy some people. I don't know, but that's the way it is. Um, so yeah, it's next Friday, at 8 p.m. The link's going to be sent out by Townsend to you know to your email. Now, there's going to be a full interactive live chat because obviously it's a live stream. So to actually participate in the live chat, you'll need to start yourself a YouTube account. That doesn't mean you have to start a YouTube channel. Honestly, I, I keep saying to people, you just need to start a YouTube account. I don't want a YouTube channel. No, you, you're not starting a YouTube channel. You are starting a YouTube account and a YouTube channel is, a, is, a, is an asset that you get as part of that, but you don't have to use it. So yeah. To be able to actually chat and for your name to come up and stuff, you'll have to have a YouTube account. Now, if people aren't familiar with how to do that, there's a million and one really quick, easy tutorials, funnily enough, on YouTube. Um, but it, it, it's just a, it's just like setting up an email. Do you know what I mean? It's it's very quick. And that just means that you'll be able to interact with us. Um, all right, next thing. So this is all being set up by me uh, and Ross McCulley and Pete Fletcher. Like the live stream is totally down to us. Townsend were going to be handling it, but there's been a bit of complication with various things. Basically, we don't have an official The Music YouTube channel, or we do, but no one knows how to get into it. It's the same with the Twitter. Look, I know, I know, it's really frustrating and it, it looks unprofessional. Uh, but it is the way, it's the, it's, it's, it, it is what it is. So the stream is going to be on my channel. But that doesn't really matter because you won't be able to find it. You won't be able to go on my channel at, on the 2nd of September at 8 p.m. and find it. It won't be there. It will. It's hidden. You'll only be able to get to it through the link that Townsend issues you. So as I say, if you do want to be part of that live stream, just buy a CD or buy the vinyl. And you know, if you're like, well, I ain't got a CD player or a turntable, well, you get a digital download code with either of those. So you know you can just have your physical as a keepsake or whatever if you're just going to listen on on your on your um, in your digital library. <coughs> um, so what next then? Yeah, um, I know it's been that, that's why I haven't been doing many podcasts or other things really because this has been a lot of work. That this this whole live album has been put together by me, Tony Perrin, and Ross McCulley pretty much, uh, and Nicola McCulley. Like the entire live at Temple News, I'm all all the artwork, everything, all the promotion. It's all been me, Tony, Ross, and now and Nicola, and now Pete's on board in terms of live um, live screening. And Ross Ross McCulley has done all the editing as well for the live stream. Now there's a couple of things because we have the straight footage that we got from as because I've said this as well. <clears throat> Excuse me. The actual footage from the gig we didn't commission it's nothing to do with us it you know it was future sound who had the cameras all there on the day to film for the big screens so all we've done is hijack that footage 
It was never filmed with the intention of giving it to us to use as a live screen, you know, as many people have said a DVD. It, it, it's not set up like that. But so, anyway, the point being, we have two versions now. <clears throat> we have the original version, which is just the straight camera feeds from the big screen. And then Ross is actually um, working on um, working on introducing other aspects, and that's what we did the other day when we put the Dropbox up on my Twitter was to bring in good quality fan footage and in crowd footage just to try and add a little bit of an extra dimension to it because obviously when they just because it's filmed for the big screens, it it it's not filmed in a way that you would want to film a live DVD. Do you know what I mean? So there are. There are shots that last too long, do you know what I mean? Sort of stagnant shots that last too long that aren't particularly interesting and <clears throat> there is actually a little bit of corruption on the original footage as well so we're trying to smooth that out and make that not so obvious and just try and make it, um, well try and use it to our advantage really and just in um, cutting some interesting stuff but we'll see how that works out anyway uh, but Ross is a genius so that I'm sure that's going to be ace. But yeah, we're, we're all really looking forward to it. Um, the other three lads will be in the chat as well. <clears throat> now, so the only thing to say is, I mean, I, I do live streams every week. So I know what I'm doing to a degree. So does Pete, because Pete doesn't with me and stuff. <coughs> and anyone that's a patron will have been involved, excuse me, will have been involved in the um, the last dance live stream that we did. So we can handle a live stream, so it's all tested, we're all set up, it's ready to go. Um, there shouldn't be a problem. Do you know what I mean? <clears throat> Excuse me. There shouldn't be a problem, but you never know. And I worry about everything. Do you know what I mean? I fret about everything. So even though we've tested everything, everything is set up and all everything's left just ready to go you know my mind's still sat there going well you know what if what if something's happened in between so obviously we've we've scheduled it now and the link sent out so <clears throat> basically what I'm saying is I hope it I hope it goes flawlessly but I do ask that people understand that we are doing our best to, to make this happen and to make it professional and to make it run right um, and best you know best laid plans obviously don't always come to fruition the way you'd like them to but it should do but what I'm basically saying is work with us do you know what I mean if if we start the stream and there's a problem um, we'll 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 rectify it the only issue we'll have is um, well, I won't get into it too much, but if there is some sort of catastrophic problem, it's probably going to be difficult to. Um, well, I don't know. We'll see. We should be at, we should be at a workaround as long as everyone's patient and um, you know keeps their eye on socials and things like that for any updates. And I'll try and update you as best I can. Um, what else? What else? What else? What else? Yeah, I have said if you want to chat, you'll need a YouTube account. But if you don't want to chat, you can just click the link and you can watch. Um, what else? So, because it's an interactive live stream, as I say, there will be a live chat with us. Uh, similar to the listening party, but obviously just in one place, not spread across different Twitter accounts. Um, but if you aren't available to watch the stream live with us, you can play it back and the live chat will replay for anyone that's not familiar with YouTube, when you watch a stream back, usually under the screen, there'll be a little horizontal menu, and right in the middle, there'll be a button that says live chat, or live chat replay. So if you press that, the live chat will appear below. Now, if you're watching on the phone, it'll split your screen, and the chat will be in the bottom half of the screen. <clears throat> if you watch on a TV, the chat will appear in front of the feed, but you can turn it off again with that button <clears throat> excuse me it's morning with that button along the middle if you press that it'll disappear the live chat so you'll just be looking at the footage and you you know if you don't want to be distracted by the chat um, that's totally up to yourselves oh yeah uh, I just thought it'd be more fun and interactive 
we planned at first to do it as a full interactive live stream. We've had issues. I mean, this has been on and off about five times. This, like every day, there's something like, oh no, that that means we can't do that. But then we find a workaround. Honestly, like Ross McCulley, Nicola McCulley, I can't put into words how much they. Um, well, it's difficult to describe, really. I mean, they're just... Uh, well, as well as being some of the nicest people I've ever met, they're some of the most talented as well, and some of the most giving of their time. Um, yeah, and and obviously, Pete Fletcher, who's going to be running the stream with me. He's the man responsible for getting the feed to my YouTube. It's, it's modern technology, man. It's absolutely brilliant. He's over there in wherever he is. He's in uh, North Carolina, not South Carolina. He'll cut me head off if I get that wrong. Uh, he's over there in North Carolina, broadcasting uh, straight over to my YouTube and straight out to you guys. But yeah, man, it's going to be good. So when Townsend issue you the link, you, you should be able to click on a link straight away. That will take you to a waiting room with the artwork for the record. It'll have a countdown and it also should have a little box that says um, set reminder. So when you get the link, click on it, go straight into it and set your reminder. You should be able to see that counting down. And then at 8 p.m. on the second, uh, bang on 8 p.m. there'll be a five minute countdown with another waiting room. And then obviously that, that will hopefully give people time to get in. I mean, there may be some stragglers and things, but you know, we'll we'll just be running it at eight. We can't. Um, well, we might hang around a few minutes, but we can't. We won't be hanging around a long time. Like, oh, I'm still in the pub. Give me an hour. Like, no, it don't work like that. I'm sorry. I, you know, like I, people are great, and like the support we've been getting and I've been getting from people has just been absolutely brilliant. Um, but yeah, sometimes, sometimes people. Uh, I don't know. People are just excited aren't they but you know so oh i'm not i'm not available that night can you do it the week after <laughs> uh unfortunately not so yeah anyone that can't make it unfortunately you'll have to watch the live chat replay but it's still you know man, that's that's still vibey um so yeah it will anyone who does want to catch it who's not available on friday the idea is it stays up until midnight on sunday oh that's something else to bear in mind when the stream finishes, you'll have to give it a few minutes to process before you can watch it back, okay? So, you know, quite a few people might want to finish the stream and then watch it straight back. You'll have to wait a little bit for YouTube to process it, basically. It's just, it, I, I never hang around to see how long it takes when I do my live streams. I just shut my laptop and then in the morning, everyone's watched it. Um, but it might take 10, 15, 20 minutes, half an hour before you can re-watch it. As I say, it's just got to, because it's all happening live, YouTube effectively has to record it and then process it afterwards once it's finished. Um, so you won't be able to watch it back instantly. Give it at least half an hour. Give it half an hour and give it a try and if that don't work, give it 45 and then give, you know, give it an hour if in the end that doesn't work. But it will be there. Um, but yeah, in terms of what happens to it then, to be honest, that's it depends on it depends on quite a few things really because you know if Ross works his magic on it and it ends up being very different, well, you know, different enough to what was filmed. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not sure about releasing it. The political aspects of that aren't necessarily in our favour, really. But there, you know, I don't know. I don't know. It just seems a shame for that to never see the light of day again. <coughs> but at the same time, you know, it's it's you know it's supposed to be it's supposed to be an incentive to to buy the physical and to come join us to to celebrate the you know the night that we had, which was amazing. So I'm trying to think is anything more to say really. Um, I suppose one thing that gla blaringly, blaringly, blaringly obvious that I should say is um, just a little bit about my record. Now, I know I've made a lot of videos saying my record's coming, my record's coming, my record is coming. But as <laughs> this live album wasn't planned, so after Temple News have happened, it was supposed to be a case of me straight back into my stuff. But 
we we'd recorded it with a view to see how it went and it went so well and it sounded so great straight away me and tony were like let's let's sort this out as a live album um and that just led to me and tony being on phone with it all day every day for god knows how long and we still are pretty much a million emails a day but there's a lot to discuss a lot to flesh out and if i'm being perfectly honest i've, I've really enjoyed it i mean i know that it's delayed the release of my record because me and you know the team in inverted commas which is me nicola mcculley ross mcculley and pete fletcher um we've we've been we've been working on this we've been working on the music live album getting that all ready um so yeah for anyone who sat there going mate where's your album <laughs> it is coming we'd hope to do the pre-order around october um but we're still working on this stuff do you know what i mean ross is still working on the stream and other bits so once all that's finished it's back over to my record and get my pre-order sorted uh, which i can't i can't wait i've i've refrained from talking about it too much because to be quite honest i got sick of telling of going it's coming it's coming it's coming and looking like some sort of idiot do you know what i mean it, it, there is no rush it is coming it's been fully recorded mixed and mastered for quite a few months now but obviously timing's everything and i, I want to get the music live album out of the way and once that's out of the way it's me headlong into my projects then do you know what i mean uh, it has to be it has to be don't get me wrong i love the music i absolutely adore the music but i can't dedicate all my time to something where it's kind of like um well it's not okay it's not a sense that i'm the only one that really wants to push forward with anything but um it's just not the best place for me to spend all my time and enthusiasm which i have an awful lot of so i don't i don't like putting my enthusiasm into things that aren't what's the word i don't know reciprocated or appreciated i don't know what the word would be um but yeah i've got a lot to give me an awful lot to give and it's about um working out where is the best place to put my efforts for the maximum benefit to my mental health do you know what i mean because that's that can be a problem with me um things like that can seriously adversely affect my mental health if i feel that um i don't know what the word is really if i feel like i'm pushing against hard waves or waves that aren't going to break or you know in my favor it's just like well i can't waste energy there do you know what i mean i can't waste energy on things like that i have to put my energy into positive things that make me feel good about myself. So I suppose that's the other thing is, um, um, yeah, like I say, it's all about keeping a good balance on my mental health, and that, that's true for everyone, you know, especially at the moment. Life is about that. It's about finding the things in your life that that enable you to keep your head above water and maintain a level of um, <clears throat> progressive cognitive sanity. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? So. Yeah, once this live album's boxed off after the live stream, then that's me uh, headlong into preparing my pre-order, which, to be honest, it's just about ready to go. I mean, well, it's all ready to go. Um, what else is it to say? I think, I think that's about it. <clears throat> I think that's about it. Yeah, um... Yeah, I mean, don't don't get me wrong. I, um, I, every, every, we all we all love the music, but ev everyone, everyone, everyone's busy now. Do you know what I mean? Everyone, everyone's busy, and so am I. So am I. And if everyone's kind of mad on it, then everyone puts their enthusiasm into it. Banging on there, but like I say, um, the gig was amazing. The reunion show was amazing. It will be amazing if we perhaps do some cool gigs in the future. Um, but yeah, no one's no one sat around, no one sat around thinking that the music are gonna reform and make a new record. No one sat around thinking that. Um, but I I I I I'm up for help me. If everyone else is up for stuff, I'm up for stuff. You know. But if everyone else isn't, then it's hard for me to engage myself with it too much. But I'm very excited about this live stream. Uh, really honoured that it's going to be on my channel. Um, that is not through design, that's through the suggestion of everyone that's been advising us basically. As I say, while we were while we were trying to set up a new band channel, um, the people who were advising us were like, 
well, look at Adam's channel, it's absolutely amazing. Why, you know, why do we do it on that? So, it does make more sense, it does make more sense, and I don't mind. Um, and at the end of the day, it puts all the responsibility on me, and it's me that's got to get it right. It's me that's got to make sure it runs right, and it's me that got to make sure that all the stuff that we're using is proper. Do you know what I mean? And don't, and I bloody will. I bloody will. I certainly will. And I'll, um, yeah, I'll be, I'll be quite upset if it doesn't work the way I think it will, but it should do. It should do. And if it don't bear with us, and we'll bloody do it another night. I, like, I ain't been beaten. I ain't been beaten by hope. So yeah, if there are any technical grem gremlins, fuck them. We'll sort it out. Um, we'll sort it out. All right. Oh else? Oh else? Oh else? Yeah. So the podcast will be back soon. Um, it, a, it got really in hot, and upstairs in the house was a no-go zone. And B, as I say, my mind's really been focused on this um, and making sure making sure it all works. I think we're good. I think we're good. We're all set up. All that's left now is for me to sit around, fret and worry, pace about. <laughs> I won't wear a hole in my carpet. Don't worry. Um, I think we're just about there. I think we're just about there now. I'm trying to think is there any last bits of detail I've left out because it's amazing how many of these videos I can do, posts I can put out with information in. People still come back asking the questions that you've covered, which you know, I'm, that's fine. People, um, that's fine, man. You know, I'm not. I don't get frustrated about that stuff. Um, although, well, I say that um, I can be, I can and have been quite curt and to the point on some Facebook replies, and I do apologise about that. Um, <clears throat> just like anyone, though, I'm human and. First thing on the morning, I'm, I'm relatively filterless. <laughs> so you can get some quite blunt messages out of me, but I never mean it with any kind of, you know, malice or anything like that. It's just sometimes, um, as you can appreciate, when you, answer, when you answer the same questions a million times and you feel like you've put the info out there already, sometimes you can be a bit, like I say, a bit curt or a bit straight to the point. But, uh, but I do apologise if I have um, offended anyone in that sense. And... I tend to, I tend to have these moments. Do you know what I mean? Filter, filterless moments where you're like, no, oh, I'm gonna have to go back and make that right. But that's all right, you know. I always do. I always do. Uh, because you know, all of us say things we don't mean in the heat of the moment, and I'm, I'm entirely governed by emotions. You see some people who claim to or purport to be sort of masters of their emotions or whatever, but um, I'm not. I'm ruled by them, absolutely ruled by them, and I don't see that as a bad thing either. Do you know what I mean? Gets my blood up. It's what life's about, man. Passion, enthusiasm, and determination in everything. Well, yeah, I think that'll do. I'll have fun trying to get off this car park now, but it doesn't matter because I'm in car, I've got Talk Sport, I've got my coffee, and i got a vape. Sunday, innit? And the stream's set up, so I don't really have to worry. I think that's about it. I think that's about it. Didn't intend this video to be this long, but you know me, I like to wrap it once I get started. Um, yeah, I think we're just about there. Nice one. I hope to see you all in the stream. Look out for your link from Townsend, I think, on Wednesday. Um, sign up for a YouTube account if you want to be in the live chat. <clears throat> And then as it stands, you will have till Sunday night to, to watch it back. I might not cut it off at midnight. Do you know what I mean? Because people might be watching it or whatever. I might cut it off a little bit after that. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see, won't we? But right, I am... Um, I'm off. Although it's quite nice to sat here in this sunshine. Yeah, I can't... Uh, I don't think there's anything else to cover as part of all this. Yeah, I just can't wait to start getting my record going now. And the other thing, this has been a brilliant, this has been a brilliant dry run for me. I've I've made God knows how many contacts, really, really, you know, really important ones that are going to work wonders for me going forward and making my own music and releasing it, which is obviously what I'm doing now. 
and that is uh, that's my life now is uh, making my own music and releasing it nice and simple suits me down to the ground it's something that I love something that I was born to do I shall crack on and do it man and yeah anyone who wants to be part of my live streams just needs to sign up to my patron um, my patron sign up page is in my bio on Twitter it's on Podbean if you go onto the podcast page it's on there uh, obviously tiers 3 and 4 are the ones that get sort of everything and they get my new song demos and that but if you if you want to sign up to a lower tier you still get access to the live streams which are getting better and better uh, technology on that front's getting better it sounds ace I'm getting bang into them that's the thing about the latter of my live stream though sometimes it's proper vibey and guitarists flying about left right and centre and then sometimes I can't do jack shit it's kind of a very organic thing and if it don't work I tend to sit there and go well I think you can all see it's not really working let's talk about what, what's everyone's favourite chocolate or <laughs> shit like that which can lead to some really interesting debates but with American if, if you're talking about it with an American like Fletch <laughs> Anyway, 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 enough of that, enough of that. I'm off. Um, thank you very much, everyone, for your continued support. Um, thank you to the people who are still buzzing off Temple News. I am, even though it was, what, three months ago now? Don't feel that long ago. Could do it again today, man. But anyway, nice one. I will speak to you soon, and yeah, I hope to see you all in, in that live stream on Friday. Any more questions though, just hit me up on Twitter or, or YouTube or or through the official Facebook because that's me chatting to you through the official Facebook by the way, which I'm sure you guessed. Uh, right, nice one. I'm off. Thank you. <laughs>